Well, good morning and welcome back to Brightside. In exactly 39 minutes, everyone in the Bay Area can have free pancakes. How about that? Today is IHOP's free pancake day. It is National Pancake Day, so we sent Brightside Sean Stryker to the international headquarters for flapjacks and short stacks with more. Sean, on this late breaking news. Good morning. Good morning, Rob. Yeah, so it's really super simple. You come to your uh, local IHOP and you order one of these, a short stack of buttermilk pancakes. The pancakes, like you said, completely free. All they ask is that you make a donation. Now, there's three different charities that that money will go to. It is the Children's Miracle Network Hospitals, Shriners Hospital for Children, and the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society. What's really cool is the money raised stays local. So all the money raised here in the Bay Area goes to the Johns Hopkins All Children's Hospital. I think it's important to people in our community and uh, on free pancake day, particularly to the guests that are visiting IHOP, to know that the place that treats their kids is where the money is going to stay. All right, so last year alone here locally, they raised over $200,000 for Johns Hopkins All Children's Hospital. So that's a lot of money. I'm here money. with Amanda. You're, you're one of the managers of IHOP. So how busy are you guys going to be? Very busy. Earlier we were speaking over 4,000 at least pancakes. Over 4,000 pancakes mm -hmm. just at this location. Just at this location. What do people need to know? What time can they get the free pancakes? What else do they need to know? 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Free short stack for everyone who walks through the door. And we're going to be here all day long serving them pancakes. All right, so I'm going to, you know, I'm going to help. I'm going to start making some pancakes, <laughs> getting a head start. Um, what's it like for you guys working today? Because obviously you're going to be super busy, but super it's got to be a good feeling. It is a very good feeling. It's a lot of long hours, a lot of hard time spent preparing for it, but it's great knowing that the money stays local to help the kids around here. Do you guys ever get like fancy with the pancake flipping, like when you're in the back? Like, well, there... you've got to be certified for that. You got to be certified. <laughs> I'm not. I'm going for my certification. That, that one's for you. <laughs> How was that? Was that, that was one good. okay? Good start. Pretty good. All right, so just so you know, it is great. You get your free pancakes. You help out those children. And um, who doesn't like pancakes, Rob? I know you do. I've no, I love pancakes. I guys. love them. You know, and you got to be sure to uh, to tip your uh, server as well while you're out there. Always take care of the folks that are helping you out. Sean, quick question for Amanda while you've got her there, and I've always wondered this. They've got blueberry, strawberry, real maple, classic maple syrup. Some tables, they've got like four or five. What's the most popular maple syrup? What's the most popular ma maple syrup? Because you do have a lot. What do you go through the most? Old fashioned. The old fashioned. Right. I would guess that. You know, classic. the classic old fashioned maple syrup, right? The original. Can't go wrong with it. <laughs> Good stuff, Sean. All right, that starts up at 7 o'clock this morning. Again, coastal 7 p.m., Sean. Look forward to seeing you, uh, especially today, back here <laughs> at the studio.